What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to another video. In this video I want to show you how to find our solubility from KSP. It says calculate the solubility of each of the following compounds in mole per liter. First one is PBI2, and the KSP is 1.4 times 10 to the power of negative 8. So, PBI2, lit, iodide, dissolves and it's gonna produce PB2 plus in aqueous phase plus 2I minus in aqueous phase. So when it dissolves, it's gonna produce X moles per liter of lit ion and 2X from iodide. So we can say KSP will be equal to 1.4 times 10 to the power of negative 8 equals to concentration of these ions this one is going to be to the power of 2 why to the power of 2? because the coefficient here is 2 that's it so here we have x for pb and for i we have 2x so it's going to be x times 4x squared when you multiply it it's going to be 4x cubed so 1.4 times 10 to the power of negative 8 equals to 4x cubed and when you calculate it 4x you're gonna get 1.5 times 10 to the power of negative 3 mole per liter so that's the molar solubility of lead iodide we can do the same thing for cadmium carbonate KSP is 5.2 times 10 to the power of negative 12 Cadmium carbonate in solid form is going to produce cadmium in aqueous phase plus carbonate in aqueous phase. So it's going to produce X and X. So KSP equals to 5.2 times 10 to the power of negative 12 equals to concentration of cadmium ion and concentration of carbonate both to the power of 1 because the coefficient is 1 that's going to be equal to x here's going to be x as well so which is going to be x squared so x squared equals to 5.2 times 10 to the power of negative 12 x will be square root of 5.2 times 10 to the power of negative 12 the answer will be 2.3 times 10 to the power of negative 6 moles per liter that's the molar solubility and in part c we have strontium 3 phosphate 2 KSP 1 times 10 to the power of negative 31 so we're gonna have it if it dissolves you're gonna produce the ions Two phosphate, three minus. That's aqueous. Aqueous. This one is solid. So we're gonna have three x, and here we have we can produce two x. So KSP equals to one times ten to the power of negative thirty one equals to strontium two plus to the power of three times phosphate to the power of two. So it's gonna be three x to the power of three times two x to the power of two. So that's going to be 27x cubed, 4x squared, 4 times 27 is going to be 108, x cubed times x squared is going to be x to the power of 5. That's going to be equal to 1 times 10 to the power of negative 31. Based on that you can find x, x will be 2 times 10 to the power of negative 7 mole per liter. That's the molar solubility and the final answer. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment if you have any question. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can have access to many other videos regarding chemistry, physics and math. Thank you for watching and have a great day.